Yeah. Tell us about that. Well, so now we decided to kind of, you know, expand and open up a storefront and what better time to serve my community than to give them what everyone deserves. And so I'm going to be opening a medical spa in the Rockaways in Bell Harbor to try and get my community to really sit back and relax and recover from this and take care of themselves instead of taking care of their homes. Yeah, it's a good way to sort of take a step back. That's right. What is the general sentiment out there right now in your community in terms of coming back? This is really the first, this is the first summer. Yes. People are still rebuilding though. We know the work is far from done. Work is definitely far from done, but I think people just feel so much pride in the area. It's a wonderful community. It's a great area to live. And people are excited to be back, and I think everyone's more power, the, everyone has more power than ever, and everyone's coming back and ready for the beach. That's really exciting, and you yeah. want to be beach ready, That's which right. certainly Medical Spa can, can help do a little bit for, I imagine. That's right, yeah, so we can take care of all those services and get people beach ready and just continue to make everyone feel great. Now, Tom, you also have a website. It's called thesalesexpertusa.com. What will people find there? when they want to learn more about you and what you do? They'll find some great things. So we launched our book, The X Factor Selling System, and that's the foundation for understanding what motivates people. So the, the key is to really understand whether you're in a business to motivate your customer, to get them to act in alignment with what your goal and services is. Um, number two, we provide business services to folks who want to get back on their feet. And then number three, we work to help people brand their services. So for the most part, we do pretty much full service sales and marketing uh, consultancy. And we have a great book that hit number one on Amazon in this category um, that we really believe if people read it and they know what we're about, our phone has been ringing off the hook and we feel it's going to ring even more so because we are helping businesses like Nicole. Well, you know, that's certainly good news. I know social, the social media space yes. is really critical to success, especially when you're bouncing back and you have limited resources. Yes. What are a few things our viewers and our folks in our online chat can learn from you on that? Okay. I always say that you need, the big, you need Facebook, you need Instagram, you want to set up a WordPress blog, oh, okay. um, you want to set up a like page for your business, mm -hmm. and then lastly, I'm a big proponent of clout, K-L-L-U-T.com. Yes, I am um, on clout. Uh, what is your score? I haven't checked recently, but okay. it's probably not very high right My now. Score, <laughs> I, I peaked at 69, okay. and um, 65 and higher is top 5%. So the great thing is it gives you a score on how well you're doing. And at X Factor Selling Systems, we rely heavily on social media mm -hmm. because it's quick, it's easy, and it gets right to the point. And it's frankly the least expensive medium. It's the least expensive, but sometimes people abuse it and you don't. You, want, you might want to unfollow or something like that. Correct. How do you guys avoid that? How do you make sure that what you're putting out there is exactly how you want it to be and the most effective in getting business? You need to stay relevant. So, for example, a tough one. so for example, you know, I have my personal Facebook page. Yep. So, if I send pictures of my beautiful children, I probably don't want to do it on my business page, right? So, people might say very cute, but maybe not the target not audience. Not relevant. So you have to decide what's relevant. Number two, you don't want to give too much information too soon, so mm -hmm. you have to spread it out. So you really need to stay relevant, spread it out, and then whatever your message is. Like, so for example, us, we believe and we know we have a great message, we want to get it out there, but you don't want to clutter it with too much information. So every day in our Twitter page, uh, at, uh, at The Sales Expert, we send an inspirational quote out once a day. So it's not just about business, it's also about inspiring them to be great. That's a little mission. nugget, putting it out there. Little by little. And sometimes you want to show just a little leg to get to what you want to get. But I always say that joking. No pun intended here. Exactly. We're talking about spas. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> we just want to show a little bit to get there. Yeah. For the simple fact that you want to show them, you know what, hey, this person not just want, wants my business, but they actually care about me and they want to help motivate me to help inspire to be great. Well, definitely really motivating words. Nicole, one last question for yes. you very quickly. How are you projecting your next few months to look for your new business? Uh, well, I consult Tom for that. Yeah. <laughs> He's projecting how my business is going to look. But, um, you know, I'm just hoping for the best and hoping for success, of course. And that's really it. I'm just well, ready. <laughs> it sounds like you're rearing to go. You have a bunch of great tools. We wish you all the best. Thank you Thank so you much. both for joining us today. Thank I hope you'll come us. back. Yeah.